In this video I will be showing you how to calculate pixel area of a band or image in Google Earth Engine. First of all I will find the area of my polygon inside a GIS software. This is an optional step so you can skip to the Earth Engine code part using the timestamps provided below. For this demo I am using QGIS I will quickly check my project settings and change the units to square kilometers. Then I will open the attribute table and using a field calculator, I will calculate the vector area. It shows the area of my polygon to be 878 square kilometers. I have uploaded this vector to my assets in Google Earth Engine. Next I will quickly filter an image of Sentinel-2. I clip the image using my polygon asset. Next to calculate the pixel area inside Google Earth Engine, we use the e.image.pixelarea function. This function requires no arguments, but to specify the image for which we want to calculate the area we use .addBands function. Here we give the image we clipped. And to display pixel area as object on console, we have to use reduce region function. Remember while dealing with area we always use the sum reducer. I will not explain reducer in detail here. Please watch my video on reducer in Google Earth Engine. The scale is going to be 10 meters as I am using 10 meters Sentinel-2 bands. Set the best effort to true to suppress memory errors. When I run the code it shows error that output is too large. Don't worry errors are good. I will select few bands and that fixes the problem. On console if we expand the object, a property area is added. But it shows us the area in square meters. To convert simply divide it by scaling factor. And now the area is in square kilometers. If you remove the best effort you will get the too many pixels reducer error. So it is always a good practice to use the best effort with reducers. Code link given in description if you learned something. Please like this video. I put so much hard work and research on the videos before even making one. Subscribe to my channel and share. I'll see you in the next one.